Hey there, welcome back and thanks for joining me. All my supplies and equipment are down in the description box below. They have links to them, so check that out. And if you like this video, hit that subscribe button. If you want to be notified when new videos come out, hit that notification bell and give me a thumbs up. That helps a lot and let me introduce this. I know y'all have seen this for a while now. Um, this is the Tim Holtz Tonic Studios, but it's a glass mat. Um, absolutely love it. I just washed it because I had acrylic all over it, which y'all don't get to see because of the um, paper. So, it's right on the edge and that was bothering me. I cleaned this. Took the little plastic scrubbies, scrubbed over it a couple places. I took um, a little Brillo pad ish, not really, it's those copper ones. Um, barely walked, did it over it, but I'm telling you, I didn't scratch it. I'm like, this is awesome. I wouldn't probably recommend that a lot, but I just had glue where I had uh, been messy. But what's so cool about this is. Alcohol ink markers. You draw on them. And then, so you can make this a little bit of a palette, even for watercolors. This would be awesome to put your paints down and do your mixing right there. So that would be awesome. Uh, stamping. If you're doing rubber stamps, you can take a magic marker and rub. Sorry, I'm shaking my table rub on there and then do your stamp on it i mean just tons of stuff so this is really cool it's down in the description so check that out i had some people asking and there it is i will probably do a equipment run over summary uh on the things i use um i know that was a huge question when i first got started so uh, yeah, I, I think I'm going to try to put the information in one spot, and I'm going to pull down just a little bit, because when I'm watching something, I like to be in the trenches. So, I'm going to do something, and I, I kind of, life, you know, everybody's got it, so... I had no ideas. I thought, I'm going to look through. I keep cards that I get. And I look through old pictures. And sometimes I look through new pictures that I, you know, online or something. And I ran across this. I don't know what I was doing. I don't know if I was making um, gray to stamp letters out. Or I don't know what I was doing. I ran across this and thought, really quick, this is what I want to do. I want to make using the pinata mantilla black the wispy then i am going to use my black acrylic and my white acrylic and make abstract and just when i said that something else popped in my head but i think i'm gonna, I'm gonna do that I can do that other later. Um, although what I'm thinking is really cool. No, no, no. I'm going to stick with this because this is what I do. Right in the middle, I change. I'm going to see. I love the look and crispness and the just effect of black and white. So, that's what I'm going to do. Um, so, all right. I'm going to write this down. Now, this is been the marker that I'm okay with. Um, and then the acrylic, just a white and a black. All right. <clears throat> okay. So these are the colors I'm using. And I've got my Revlon here. 
my Revlon blower. It's got three settings, a cool with high volume, a low heat with high vo sorry, low heat, low volume, high heat, high volume. Okay, so let's get going. Put some ink down. I don't want this real dark, but I do want definitely some there. We'll see. I'm going to turn this on high heat. When I'm moving a lot around, I try to hit high heat just seems to be better. Okay. Ooh, wait. All right. I'm pretty happy with that. I know it was going to go dark at the very end, but um, it's all right. So what I want to do, and I don't know if I want to do big stuff or little stuff. Um, 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 make a decision. And I do appreciate everybody not going, geez, decide already. Everybody's so nice <laughs> not to say, I have this figured out before you do this. But that's just kind of part of what I do. I just, I like to sit down and do one thing and now I'm deciding what I want to do from here. Um, I want to do something like this. Okay. 
uh, this was probably not going to show up on that, which is perfectly fine with me. Um, I just want something like that. And we'll definitely put one through that. Um, okay. We'll do that. Now we'll do one. Let me stick this in the black a little bit. The black's a little thinner. Which does help in getting it distributed. I have shut the door between my dad's TV, which he has it on a thousand and two, and yeah, so he's like, "Oh my gosh, a shut door! I, I can't get in." And he's like, "Freaking!" Ooh, I okay, <laughs> that I like. I like that up against each other. That is awesome. Um, yeah, he's... They're cats. They're just typical cats. I'm going to try very hard not to do just too much. I like to do that, and... I don't know. Okay, so here I'm going to put a little bit of alcohol, run this through it, and I don't know if that was even enough. I definitely like keeping all of these um, elements together. I think that's what I'm maybe going to do. It's just... This would have been really cool with pitch black, but pitch black, remember, has the brown and blue. And this is the true, like, black that will go gray. And where's my card? This is where we're kind of going to look and see what I've got going. Um, I want to do... I don't have enough still. Put through there. Oh, even better. I do like that. Okay.
and the white. I don't want too much of that because that does get a little repetitive, I think. Um, And I like that brokenness. If it was just a straight line, I think it'd be a tad boring. I'm getting off this page. Um, hmm, let's see. Okay. Caps. I'm going to use this one. Don't throw them away. They're great for... That's oh, smaller. They're great for just doing something like this. I don't know why I keep reaching all the way back here when I could just put it up toward my stick. Stylist. I lost what I was going to do. What was I doing?
that that quick it's gone I don't even know what I was wanting to do here I have no idea what I was going to do. All right, where is shot glass? And this is black. And I'm going to offset it just an inkling. There, there, and there. I'll take it in the white. Do the same. I'm going to offset it as little. I think what I might do here is put me a black dot, maybe off to the side in each of these. And maybe just something like that. I want a little bigger dots. That one's a dot. There we go. You want kind of a flat bottom-ish on those. It's really hard to decipher with this just being black and white. So this has a dark area. I need some white over here. I don't think I have enough dots. Um... Just something to throw it a little bit. 
I don't like that because it's not solid. So that, that throws that. You know, I was tempted to put like one red thing in there, but no, 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 I'm not going to do that. Yeah, I don't, I don't even know. This may be my shortest ever. It's, there's not a lot to do on this. Let me think. What I am going to do is I think I'm going to do a spot like, well, there now that I've done that. Got it on low heat, low air. What I'm drawing is I've got alcohol running around the glass. Let me see if I can show you. I don't know if you can see it. Um, it's running around. So I know there's a lot of alcohol underneath. And what I'm wanting to do is dry this. Because if I don't, it's going to run outside the circle. So whatever is, is seeped out here, I want to dry. Now real quick, when I pull this off. One, hold it down because if you pull it and the thing come, the sheet paper comes with it, and you're not going to be happy. So I hold it, and then very quickly I'm going to take this dryer to it. I do, I like that. I want something here. I don't know why this spot just... But it's got the acrylic on it, too. So, I don't know how that's going to react. And it may react very coolly. But I really want something in all that crisscross right there. That That's bugging me. Oh, shoot. I did that. Err.
Okay, I don't see any running out. So I'm lift it up. I do want to do something like here. So I am about done. Um, what I do want to do is get um, my little mop. I love these brushes. They are absolutely awesome. And I'm going to do... I'm needing some more. Okay. All right, I'm calling that one done. All right, go pick up one color and play. Y'all have fun.